Welcome to our winter concert this evening. Uh, I've had the pleasure of working with your children since uh, the beginning of school year. I can assure you they are not boring. They are entertaining, they are energetic, and I am exhausted at the end of every day because they always keep me guessing about what they're going to say next. But they balance it out with being fantastic film musicians. So I hope you are impressed with what we're going to be doing this evening and can't wait for you to head back here in the spring to hear how much they've improved. Public service announcement the sign ups for the instrumental program at the middle school will be coming out very soon. So keep that in mind when you're filling out their lecture schedules. Now, I'm going to introduce our speakers who will take over for the rest of the evening. And then we'll be playing some songs for you. So our speaker, uh, first speaker is Parnas, and our second speaker is Chris. So come on up. Oh, 
children. Rumor had it that Mary had Mary came to school that day, and her little lamb thought it would be from his father. You will now play Mary had a little lamb for you.
Moms are all about work, but don't worry. We promise that you will still have plenty of fun here in Houston. Some songs are made to sing at the time while you're working, and some songs are about different types of work that people might do. And we will even sing about a dream job that we might all want to try out. We have been practicing and working hard since the start of the school year, so we can hear those songs. We want to be sure you hear every word and every note. So silence your phones, sit back, and get ready for a great night of music. The first song we'd like to share with you is an old song. It's from the new story of our popularity. The well known is a traditional ballad from New Zealand, which is likely sung by past the time by workers in the whaling industry. The men were often stuck in remote outposts and relied on whaling and ships to bring more supplies. Whaling is fair to say, but in the 1800s, it was an important industry, not only in New Zealand, but also in the United States. The trade of sugar, tea, and rum was another important part of the economy at that time. Sailors in the 1800s used music and singing in many ways while doing their jobs, from work songs that helped them voice the sails, or sheets in unison, or sea shanties that entertained them on long sea voyages. The Roman has also had a second wave of popularity, recently due to viral videos on TikTok and other online platforms. Kids and teens everywhere were discovering catchy sea shanties and recording their own versions. We hope you will enjoy our version tonight. Sit back and enjoy the tale of a whale that takes a ship on a wild ride. And our first song, The Well Men. Yeah, Yep. The Lomaxes were 
interested in preserving the rich folk music tradition of America. And Mad Belly was a great source for this. After leaving prison, he went on to perform and record many well-known songs such as Good Night Irene and Midnight Special.
involves much less than a single leader than, it, than in our last song. This jazz tune by Dizzy Gillespie is about a trumpeter that wants to make it big, big playing in a jazz band. Yes, so unfortunately this trumpet player has beaten off this solo in It turns out he needs some beating when he should really be walking, and walking when he should really be. Confused, the lyrics of this song refer to a style of jazz made popular by Dizzy Gillespie called bebop. Bebop is full of fast moving, syncopated rhythms, so it might be easy to see how the musician might have, ha might have a hard time playing all of them correctly. Well, we hope all of you fans are ready to get into the groove, and we'll try our best to beat and bop at all the right times. Here is TV Club when you should have bopped by Dizzy Gillespie.
thank you again and again. Thank you for being here tonight. Thank you for all the support that uh, you give to your children, that you give to the arts. Um, Sarah has so many wonderful opportunities for that. I'll put in my public service announcement as well that, you know, as they continue on in the middle school and the high school, there are a lot more opportunities. There are, um, they have courses that they can sign up for next year, um, musicals, um, the high school musical will be coming up soon. I can't wait to see it. I hope you guys can think about the, letting, taking them to go see. That's going to be awesome and amazing. Um, but there's so much for them to learn as they grow, and I can't wait to see them as they